turn the valve clockwise into the off position. Turn off power, ensure fuse circuit is off, and turn thermostat off. Remove adjacent ignition service panel by sliding the cover away from the tube. Remove top service panel by unscrewing six screws. Unplug the flame sense wire, the spark ignition wire, and the pneumatic tubing from the electrode assembly. Remove the old spark electrode assembly by unscrewing the four screws holding it in place. Clean off any remaining gasket material from the tube with a razor blade. Install the new spark electrode assembly onto the appliance with probes angled away from the burner. Ensure no damage is done to the gasket material. Reinstall the flame sense wire, spark ignition wire, and pneumatic tubing. Feed the green ground wire with the eyelet through the conduit and into the main portion of the heater. Locate the grounding earth screw inside the main body of the heater and connect the eyelid. Reinstall the top and side service access panels. Turn on power, ensure fuse circuit is on, and turn thermostat on. Turn the valve counterclockwise into the on position. 
Visit Reverberay.com to learn more about our many lines of infrared heaters. Factory trained representatives are also available to assist in the proper selection of infrared heating equipment for your application.